Well, it's a good point. Um, good clean sheet. Um, tough decision, tough call, really, with Keno coming out, because I think he's done well. But Jared going in and that kind of back five unit last season, as you well know, kept a lot of clean sheets, and they've done again today. Um, you know, a lot of, uh, I think a solid performance, you know, that, uh, you know, that we, we, we obviously couldn't really find that, that bit of edge in the uh, attacking third and that, you know, bit of devil that sometimes is the difference and that bit of quality, of course, but a, a solid feel to the performance and didn't really give much up away from home, of course, in the Premier League, which is difficult. Fair share of using the ball and possession and, and you know, in the end, we come away Slightly, slightly, you know, wondering, you know, is that one that we could have won? But equally, on the other hand, Jordan makes a fine save. You know, I think, I don't think he's had much to do this afternoon, apart from staying focused, which is an important thing, by the way, which I said to him after. But it's a fine save to make sure that we, we keep that clean sheet and get a point. Yeah, I mean, he's going to get sharper, obviously. You know, a couple of rusty moments when he, you know, give the ball away and missed a tackle and things. But that's, you know, that's because he's lack of game time. But no, we know what a very good player is. And I did say, that, you know, it's trying to find the, the right time when he's really ready. I think he'll get more game ready. Um, but I think that's certainly a start of the process or a restart of the process. Like Jerry Starkovsky, he step up alongside and you can have Bamford having alongside him there. Well, they, well they, they, they quite obviously made a, a good partnership last season and, and you know, with, with Jordan behind them and the, and the two full-backs, like I say, not always, but a lot, them two full-backs played together last season um, with that back five. So, yeah, I was pleased with that side of things, but I thought the work in front of them was impressive. I thought um, uh, Indrissa was, was very good again today. Um, you know, a lot of the stuff that fans don't always see, not our fans, I mean, generally, you know, the, the ugly side of the game when he covers the hard yards and presses and nicks it and keeps the ball. And, and Manga thought was good again, uh, worked very hard, you know, yet again, another one, you know, that real Premier League edge and fitness comes from playing. So, yeah, there's a lot of good signs, but, you know, that, that, that bit that we've spoken about at length is that idea of that bit of devil, that bit of extra quality in the front third. And I think if we can add that in, which is not easy, of course, but that makes us more of a threat and therefore solid performances turn into winning performances. Any signs from today's performance about what you can maybe do more to find? Yeah, I think, well, I mean, I thought, I thought Jasper showed signs. Illy had moments in the game. Tom worked hard, can't quite find them moments. You know, Beto trying to mix it up, affect it differently with Jack coming on as well, you know, more technical rather than Duke and, you know, trying to find mixed ways and, and the search continues. Dwight's gone there, of course, and, you know, he has caused more trouble with technical moments and for the opposition, that is. And, you know, so just, just keep searching for the, the right mix. But obviously it would have, be help if the injuries um, die down because with Brozier coming back fit, of course, that gives you something different. It, with Youssef, who's been very unlucky, um, gives you something different again. So they hopefully will come back fit and, and add to the mix and add to the, the potential of scoring more goals. Have you got a game Yeah, they're not ready. They're, there's only, they're not quite ready for that yet. So Brozier and uh, Youssef being the main two. Um, Shay's got the hamstring, so we're going to have to settle that down. Um, no, the, the others we've got to be careful with. The, the challenge we've got quite obviously is, you know, playing the games, then not getting them re-injured. So I think we're, we're trying to come through that. We're looking at the stats of facts, as in their performance facts and stats and training facts and stats. So trying to judge the right time to get these players games, but certainly they're the main two. Papato coming back stronger as well, but they're the main two, uh, Youssef and Broju, who will need that games programme, but they're, they're building up to that now. Any further questions? No, I don't think it's the best, but I think I think we, we used the ball well. We opened up the, their shape well at times. Um, you know, early on in the game, we have a, a really good breakaway because the game works in different ways, as you know. So the counter and Duke just takes a little bit too long to finish it. And, you know, sort of maybe moments, that, and, and you know, that, but they're important, of course. And, you know, that belief with them moments work for you, the belief that you're going to find more moments is quite obviously so the psychology of the game. But, no, I, I think we've played better in attack, but uh, I think that we're not far off. But at that bit of devil and that bit of final moment of truth, as I call it, for someone to find a pass or finish, that's a constant work in progress here. Most people buy it. We're having to continually walk the work to develop it. So I just got to think, how hard is it for a goalkeeper to say that focus? Yeah, I mean, I think he had a, one other save, but I think it was a save, you know, one that you'd expect from him. Um, and I, I did commend him on that at the end, you know, just staying calm and focused, you know, to, to what the game offers you. And he did that in a very fine uh, react. I mean, I haven't seen it back, but from where I was, it looks a really sharp save. Um, so, yeah, you know, fair play to him. Top keeper doing what, to, uh, doing what top keepers should do. Sorry, it's for me to say. Any further questions? Cheers, everyone. Cheers.